people teacher online study point and today our topic is innovations in educational technology there are different kinds of educations have been uh, innovations have been done in educational technology and there are different types of approaches uh, there as i have told you in the earlier video of, of innovations in educational technology so first uh, innovative approaches which are using uh frequently uh, by the educationist or the teachers is the multimedia approach the multimedia approach is uh, first of all we would like to know about the what is multimedia approach and how it is done so is by multimedia approach is meant the use of teaching material in different forms in order to clarify a topic so the communication medium along with the instructional methods and technique is called multimedia approach so multi means different types and media means mediums so the traditional approach is that we impart any kind of knowledge from the teacher to the student through books only or by the blackboard but by multimedia approach anything any knowledge when impart to the student it is done with the help of multimedia so this uh, it's it is a kind of teaching learning strategy which is designed to achieve certain goals with the maximum utilizations of techniques and media in proper combination so communication in the medium plus instruction methods plus techniques plus media this is multimedia approach so you all can write it down that uh, in multimedia approach four things combined very well first is communication medium or you can say the instructional method plus techniques and plus the media all these combine in a proper combination for uh, achieving the maximum teaching learning experiences characteristics of multimedia approaches so uh, multimedia approaches should always be integrated all the things should always be integrated with each other it must always be computer controlled the information they handle they must be represented digitally uh, by the use of internet or intranets the interface to the final presentation should always be interactive so uh, the characteristics of multimedia can be many more like uh, it uh, help the learner to learn in their own pace and the multimedia approach is proving useful in all kinds of educational system it may be formal non formal or informal all in we can use the multimedia approach in all these kinds of uh, types of education and research studies also reveal that use of different multimedia approaches against a single approach makes teaching learning process easier simpler and more effective which is the um, aim of the innovation in education system now selection of appropriate media so there are different different uh, types of multimedia system devices like capture devices storage devices communication network computer system and display devices so you can write it all down video recorder key hard disk internets intranets multimedia and color printers mobile so these are all multimedia uh, uh, which we are using in education for importing uh, imparting a quality education and for the fulfillment of the students educational need as per their ability as well as making the course material quite comprehensible for comprehensible for those who uh, wants a peaceful education as well as a little uh, slow education all kinds of educations can be uh, given by the appropriate media now next the process of selecting the media so first of all we will how a teacher will uh, select the uh, suitable media for uh, 
doing or imparting a educational course or you can say a course material which can be comprehensible so there uh, goes a process of applying the multimedia approach so selection process is there so first of all uh, as you all can see we will conceptualized our project we will plan its cost it, we will design it and then we'll gather the data collect it then we analyze it and organize it then navigation and map structure designing will be done media content will be get designed and storyboarding multimedia authority testing and delivery is then so we will uh, we can use graphics we can use text so before using multimedia in any kind of education system or uh, planning any kind of courses we have to go through these steps for creating a suitable media uh, for learning now next is what is the importance of multimedia approach so multimedia approach is important because very very important because it keeps better control over the learners they can practice as per their own need and can examine their progress and these are these are user friendly uh, they are there is inter interactivity it is self paced cost effectiveness saves time and it is meaningful as well as very very comprehensible so uh these are the important of uh, multimedia approaches and in next process we are going to study about a new innovation system that is psi that personalized system of instruction so keep watching the gyan dhara and please write down your notes please like share and subscribe